Sarah, how's it going? Good, good, it's thank going good. Thank you. What has your experience been like with the breadwinner? It's been pretty amazing, I have to say. After, let's say, four years since we began, our, um, you know, with their script and all the way through the production, which basically means, you know, we have, we had some, you know, amazingly energetic uh, <laughs> days and that, you know, kind of thing yeah. with uh, uh, recording our cast. Uh, but most of it is is very somber behind you know computer screens. You're there with your teams of animators and that. So so to to come out into the into the light and uh, <laughs> and uh, and then come to a festival like TIFF. I mean, it's a homecoming for the breadwinner because a lot of the work was done here with our studios uh, in, in Aircraft Pictures and, and and Guru and you know. So it's 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 fantastic to have a premiere here. And based on a Canadian book as well. Yeah, too. and yeah. Jack Addis's book. Yeah, it's great to have it premiering in Canada where you know. It all originated. Mm -hmm. But it still feels like an international production. Exactly. Yeah. It's Everybody very universal. Involved. The process of animation is really interesting, and I think that the gifts that animation brings to the screen are, are pretty unique, you know? So that we, we always look at ways of layering our story in a way that adults will get something out of the film and children will get something else out of the film, yet we're all watching the same screen, and that we can uh, infuse uh, history and culture into our project, but also just have uh, very, uh, you know, flawed, real characters mm -hmm. that have strengths, certainly, but are, are very real um, people and and you know having performances like Sarah's in the project just gave us as as animators all the material we needed to make sure that their characters felt real even though at the end of the day they're lines they're just drawings moving across the screen you know. You. Lastly, where do you think your journey will take you? You know, I don't know. I follow stories and I follow characters. And when I get the chance to work with actors like Sarah, you know, it absolutely enthuses me to just continue telling stories. So, you know, who knows?